well, um, guess I'm back because I got wind of news that more stuff has happened to the translation as a whole for this whole update that I did not know about. So Akko and Ibuki, this was old, but well, not really old. This was recent, but I didn't know this either. So I'm going to talk about both of these before we talk about both of these. Um, in my recent video with the um, translations, I made a mistake with the weapon. So this right here with the whole who violates the schools or disrupt the public morals, but this time it's Hina treats and gently for the sake of someone else. Yeah, this is actually the right translation and I messed up. So that was my fault. But let's get on with the translation real quick with Akko because no, I, well, I know, buddy, I didn't know about this and uh, this is getting annoying. So this is this is the English version and it's a why why is it a a fucking cheerleader joke be tenacious be e tenacious man me even saying that sounds so fucking cringe and that's coming from a nigga who posts got who plays gotcha and simps over gotcha characters so that explains a lot if I'm saying that shit's cringe. And then we're going to go to the Korean version and then Korean Google Translate. Oh my gosh, you are persistent. Well, that's persistent. And you know, this is the best thing we got. They also translated to Japanese as well. Really, you are persistent, aren't are you? Now, I'm not no Einstein or what you would call the most intelligent nigga out there. But I think if a person was giving me this kind of look, I don't think they would make a fucking cheerleader joke with this kind of look. Like, Akko is staring you down, my nigga. She's fucking pissed. So in my eyes, I don't think she would be saying this. This of saying you are persistent, well, that's persistent, or really you are persistent aren't you like this is something she would say this is dead ass what she would fucking say with a look like this and everybody else is kind of like yeah this is just some stupid ass goofy writing so it's okay the english writing does not mesh well with the vibe akko is looking and sounding angry yeah i was gonna say i'm just glad someone else agreed like look at her face this does not match on what the fuck she's doing bro it really doesn't it gives off a whole stupid ass vibe. She has an angry ass look, so she's angry about something. Why turn it into a joke when the situation is not a joke at all? Picture this, right? A picture if they did this shit with a very, very serious moment. Like if the English translators really did not give a fuck, which they don't. If they fucked up, well, they probably did. There's probably people gonna already tell me in the comments. If they did like volume f like if they did the responsibility scene and people will know exactly what i'm talking about if they fucked up the translation on the, on the responsibility scene that would have like taken that would have taken so many people out of the fucking like what is it um immersion they, it, they would have been clocked right out the immersion i would have too because this is this is annoying this is honestly fucking annoying and i know there's i, I saw a comment saying well, why are you, why are you doing this? It's like we're still you either better learn a new language, or some shit's gonna or this shit won't happen. The thing is, yeah, learning a new language is cool and all, but that takes time. That <laughs> that takes time, and learning a new language like Korean or Japanese is not easy. It is not simply as I just pick up a book or I pick up an app and I can just learn it within like a week. It's not that easy. It is not. And the thing is, they've made changes to the translation before so we know that they can change it we just have to push this out to them we gotta keep submitting these supports because they have changed it in the past i forgot i think they changed uh, correct me if i'm wrong guys i think they they changed the kikio one i think kikio's was changed there was problem with it people saw it then they made changes on it so yeah i'm glad that should that they're actually looking at this port stuff and they're going to be changing it so we have to keep telling them like hey you know your translators are having problems right like you know the translators are doing this like you need a better translation team or 
literally go with the snow break route i'm just saying go with the snow break route the fans translations do much do the do the fucking game justice at this point if you really want to connect with your fans just pull a snow break and just help get the help from your fans but that's the whole Akko situation here is the ibuki situation now ibuki's whole thing is she speaks in the third person yeah 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 no no no. was it first person no third person now it's third person i was like which one is it which one because first person you would just say i and then say third person you'd be speaking to be like the you say the character's name yeah third person her whole thing is ibuki isn't soul like you know she literally just says she says her name and then says the sentence so bada bing bada boom right but this is what the en got huh i'm not selling anything she like she does not say that <laughs> she her whole thing ibuki's whole thing as a character she speaks in third person that's her whole thing she says ibuki and then bada bing bada boom simple as that but i also saw a little comment right here saying i don't care about translations as long as it doesn't break the context of the core lore well here's the thing this person said it best but the ramifications are the ramifications when you give bad local localizers a foot they will try to take a mile. For example, volume F student teacher relationship plays a crucial role to the plot. If some contents gets filtered, filtered, it would completely, it won't completely explain the motivation of the students to what they, to what they do. And that's exactly what I said earlier in the video. If they did some shit with the volume F um, scenario, student teacher relation, student teacher relationship and all that shit. If they changed anything in volume F and they fucked it up, the context of it, it would take you out the immersion. So bad translations like this, they're important. You have to worry about them. This is not something we cannot let slide. We just can't let this kind of shit slide because bad translations breaks the fucking lore and context. That's the whole thing. They break the context for English users because now people are going to be like, oh, Akko made people are gonna think Akko is just pissed off and making this dumbass cheerleader joke, but no, in actuality, she's mad at Sensei for a reason or somebody in the story. This is what happens with bad translation. This is what happens when we get bad translation right here. You get stupid shit like that, that stupid shit like this that breaks the context, and then we keep going right here with Ibuki's whole thing. This is right here. Yeah, and then she says Ibuki, she says her name and everything, and we keep going, and then we see the EN, and it's like, this was Google Translate, right here, this is the Korean version, and this is EN, Mako, I want uppies. <laughs> like, what the fuck, who the fuck says, who says uppies, like, are we 12? Well, in Ibuki's case, she's 11. But who the fuck says nobody says uppies? And the Google Translate just says it best. Ibuki, I want to climb on your back. Ah, uh, yes, Ibuki, please wait a moment. Crazy. Crazy. You see what happens when you actually give context of what the fuck is happening? Because who the fuck says uppies? Nobody says that shit. You would either say piggyback ride. That's the best you would say. Because no, everybody knows what a fucking piggyback ride, is. piggyback ride is. Then we go to here. Zero car, Mako, uh, Mako Senpai. Ibuki is all, is all on my back. And then we go to the EN. Heave ho all aboard the Mako Express. Which, I mean, it just, it, uh, it doesn't work because she she's not saying she's not being her character she's not saying ibuki that's the whole point of her character she's literally supposed to say her name it's she's just not speaking in third person in the en and it fucking sucks it fucking sucks we go to korean version google translate ibuki wants to do it too um so sasuke senpai ibuki wants to do it too we go to en hey sasuke let me try again the same thing let's keep going we got a whole bunch it's like we have shit holding holding the coin and shaking it the teacher becomes more and more i want to play with ibuki then we go to en you take a coin out swing it around now since they want to play with you it's like bruh like play with me 
Yo, she's supposed to say her fucking name, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> How is it that hard to not translate the right shit? How is Google Translate? Which Google Translate is not correct all the time. But how is Google Translate doing your job better? And it's free. That's the... How are viewers doing fan translations and your job better? It's fucking crazy. I'm just... I, it's, it's fucking crazy. But they have a link right here. I'm going to link these... Um, <coughs> I'm going to link these posts down in the description. So you can go in and do these uh, these uh, reports. Because, guys, we, we, we just need to do... We need to keep reporting this stuff, this shit. It's annoying. It is really annoying as fuck to see context be broken because of this shit. Like, God, it's it's really annoying. It's so fucking annoying. But I'm out here, boys. It's uh, I had to, I wanted to get this out, get this out the way, because these translation stuff is important, and I want to make shed the light on this kind of stuff for people who don't know about it, because this kind of stuff is well swept under the rug a little bit because not many people know about it. And I want to shed some more light on it. Like, I want to shed even more light on this kind of stuff. So, all right, T, boys. I'll see y'all later for another Blue Archive video.